Mismatched socks from one person. Yeah. You're certainly not the neatest kid in the world, that's for sure. The only dangerous thing on this desk is an old sandwich. What's next? Uh, well, I've looked under the bed. Why don't you try the closet? It's funny. I, I didn't... If you don't mind, I'm gonna go look in the night table. It's oh. okay with you. Okay, you want to tell me what's going on between you two? He wasn't at the gym this morning. He was at Lena's. So what's the big deal? He was lying. Lied? Oh. Wait, you're not seriously suggesting he's sleeping with her, are I'm you? I'm just telling you where he was, Kevin. So you're insinuating he's having an just affair? Just draw your own conclusion. I will. Okay, let me get this straight. Pardon the expression. You go to a gay party, it means nothing. He spends one day with his secretary, all of a sudden he's having this affair. You are just not going to let go of that, are you? What is it going to take to get you to understand that I am not you, okay? I know you feel you have a need to have this company, but... I, I, have, no, I have no need for any company. It's you who's stunningly all alone. Kevin, you may have grown up in a world where men walk around in public holding hands, but at the end of the day, you are one of the loneliest people I have ever known. So, where are you going? Justin's right. I'm not his father. This is your family, Nora, not mine. What's the matter? I can't do it. I can't. I can't be this person anymore. Justin. He's fine. He's been asleep for a few hours. Thank God. I've been more worried about you. Oh, no, I'm fine. No, you're not fine. You ran out of here like a crazy person. You scared me to death. What do you mean you can't be this person anymore? What person? What are you talking about? Look, I shouldn't have said what I did last night, and I'm sorry. I came here to apologize. Well, that's lovely, but I still don't know what's going on. You don't have to know everything, Nora. We all have secrets. Oh, Saul, if you have some health issue that you're hiding from me... There's nothing wrong with me physically, I promise. I'm fine. It's just hard. You know, your kids are the closest thing I have to a family. And it's not that I don't love coming here for their birthdays and holidays and... It's just not my family. I wish I had found someone that I could... God, you know I have always wanted you desperately to find somebody to love. How do you know that I haven't? Stop talking in circles. Nora, I am not who you think I am. My husband was in love with another woman for most of our marriage. Well, I was in love with a man. How about that? You what? so many years ago I... why didn't you tell me because because it was a different time different time i was there i'm your sister so i shouldn't have told yes, you yes you should have told me you should have told me a long time ago so i'm so i'm so confused i mean the women you were with and oh no kev could you just please give us a second why what's wrong Nothing. So you have to go. Saul, please don't go. Please, Can, please can. don't go. Saul. Saul. Everything's fine. Is he all right? Who? Saul. Oh, yeah, he's fine. Why? Is there something you're not telling me? <clears throat> no, no. As far as I know, he's fine. Oh. Well, fine. Just fine.